but also the founder of New Life Centers, an organization focused on helping youth in underserved areas in Chicago and also New Life Cities dedicated to planting churches in urban centers around the world. He's uh, a moody, uh, born and raised in many ways, and he's uh, with us today. Hey, Dr. Job, how are you today? Chris, I am excited to be with you today. It's a it's a good day. You know, we plan these uh, interviews and and uh, resources well into in advance. You and I were laughing a little bit. God's providence would have it that you are already scheduled to be on with. Put on the show like they don't need there you are. They got each other. We know what's going Sixties tomorrow. Wanna float away? News, New York. It's another predatory sexual assault. His next scheduled for December. Rose on Wall Street. The Dow is a it's got original 1954 uh, Chevrolet pickup. These radios are hard to come by. Uh, you can buy parts for them. And what we've done with this one is we uh, cleaned it up, redone the case, the front. This is a new bezel here. Uh, redone the dial glass, the background, polished the knobs. Uh, we even built a new uh, cover for it back here. Them covers are not really for the speaker, them covers in case uh, rain comes in through the cow enough for it to keep it off the radio. Got a new one of them on it. Uh, we've done a basic Aurora design conversion. It's got an AM FM stereo, four channels. You got two channels here. This is a 6x9 DVC 200 watt full cone. It will kick. You got two more channels you can use somewhere else. You got a right and left pre out for a sub, and right and left pre out for a set of rear speakers if you want to put a bigger amps in. Um, and it's got auxiliary in, which is automatic. This is your cable here that you plug in the radio and you can hide. And this is your mail to mail that comes with it. Plug in. Put a little uh, iPod. Oh, excuse me. It's been a long night. You can plug your phone into it. Uh, anything that's got a uh, headphones out jack. Satellite radio, CD players. Uh, you can just about pipe anything into it you want to. You can put a splitter on it. Pipe two things into it if you want to. Uh, it does uh, scan your stations for you. And uh, it cleaned up pretty nice. It's a good sound a little radio. Traveling bass like you've always had. Uncontainable. And what? Clear tonight, lows dropping down into the 40s. For tomorrow, cloudy, Start get, 65. get fall. Uh, if you want to go to AM radio, you just simply turn this unit off and right back on. It takes you to AM radio. That's 650 here in Nashville. Off and right back on, take you right back to FM stereo. You got a little operating LED down here. I know these set low in the dash, so I made it kind of low so you can see in it. And you got a stereo LED here for when you find a stereo channel. It'll light up for you. Uh, these little radios are fun to do. It just takes a little while to get all the parts, everything together. Anyhow, this is cleaned up real nice. Looks brand new. Uh, that's how you work your AM FM. Of course, you don't have no push buttons on these because there ain't that much room of the dash left where they stick out. Uh, You've got balance and fader built in your toner control. I keep getting the off and on volumes over here. If you want to go into fader, you just, you, since this is close together, you really ain't got to worry about balance, but you want to know how to work your fader. Just back this, uh, back this up just a little bit on your toner about midways and turn it twice clockwise, like a 12-2 motion. And I got two more speakers hooked up, so we're gonna go one, two. Now you're in the fader mode. 
Now, there's your rear speakers. There's that speaker. As long as you're moving this, it will stay in that mode. You're going to balance it out and let it beat. Now we're back on treble and bass. Got our rear speakers brought up so we can hear them. Well, Portland, Oregon, and slow gin pins. If that ain't love, then tell me what is uh huh. Uh -huh. Sound beat. Think you hate me? That's a game for fools. Good sound on the radio. Uh, the opposite direction, which is your balance, you want to go uh, counterclockwise, like a 12-10 motion. Uh, you don't want to throw this speaker too far out of balance. It'll make it sound kind of funny. You're going to be in a truck. You ain't going to have to do a whole lot of balance. Uh, your, uh, like I said, your uh, auxiliary end is automatic. All you do is plug a device into it and just simply turn it on. I'm going to go back in that mode, bring it back to the down a little bit. people out there cutting my grass. That's a weird song. There we go. Anyhow, you're on auxiliary end. That little light's gone to green. That little AD means you're on auxiliary end. At any time you want to come off that and go back to radio, just simply turn your device off. You don't even have to unplug it. I'm going to unplug this one. Save my battery. And it'll automatically change back over in 20 seconds. During that time, during that 20 seconds, if you want to do it quicker, you don't like the dead air, just turn it off and right back on. It remembers where you're at. We're going to let it automatically switch over. Make sure, automatically switch, make sure everything's right. Baby, little radio kick good. Uh, that's your AM FM, that's your balance, your fader. And now we're gonna do the scan. It will scan stations for you. All you do is take your tuner knob and go up twice. One, two. A little light gets to blinking back there. Now it's gonna start scanning stations of our sin. And I'll show you how to lock on it further and even find it. There's no fun in what I do. There's your neck. I wonder what went wrong. Evidently it found one, but that ain't a good one. Republican Governor Rick Scott running for a Senate seat against the incumbent Bill Nelson. Tallahassee's Democratic Mayor Andrew Gillum is in a tight race for governor. With a Hear more from Harry T. Pauly. The TSU Meister Singers were in Studio C this week ahead of their I'll performance at the upcoming Harry T. Station. Station. Yeah, this is what excites or me, Chris, even about it. about this opportunity. People have asked me. Are you sure you want to say we like that station there? All we're going to do is take the tuning knob and turn it one time. All right, it's starting flashing quick. Now, it will lock on it, or it will go quiet till you find it. If you want to mark it, there it is. Put it back in that mode. Turn it twice. Start flashing. Now, it'll start scanning. Is in the area right Back it up. It'll automatically quit for you. This is all in your manual that you'll be getting. Political. With the gospel as possible. Things and throughout this country. Anyhow, that's your original 1954 Chevrolet pickup truck radio. They uh, definitely come up with a wild one when they done that one. But this right here, those covers keep rain off of it and out of your radio. And uh, we can make them. Uh, it's easy to hook on. There's, there's two nuts and then a screw in the back. But uh, it's ready to go. I appreciate you letting me do it for you.